What up guys and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about why if you're going to be a bodybuilder you shouldn't get tattoos. Hello people and welcome to John Shepherd Fitness. If you're new to this channel please subscribe and if you actually like this video give me a thumbs up if you don't give me a thumbs down you know what doesn't make any difference to me anyway today's video is all about this stuff yes tattoos as i'm going to be competing in body power next year i've been wanting to talk about this to people for a long time um but i don't really know anybody who's competed who's got tattoos you don't see many people with tattoos in bodybuilding if you know what I mean not exactly competing you know the ones the big people in bodybuilding and I want to address and see what your opinion is on this video in the comments so please give me a comment on this video when you've watched it so what I'm gonna be talking about is don't get tattoos if you want to be a bodybuilder and that is simple um my tattoos in general have i've been i've had them for years this part on my lower arm is new but this part here you might recognize it a bit it's the rocks tattoo what well, he's got on his arm but obviously he's got it on his chest but that was before i did any sort of workouts i used to go to the gym but nothing like i do now and I wanted a tattoo you know it's one of them things you always want a tattoo you know not everybody likes tattoos but some people you think you'll have one and then it is addictive you do want more obviously I'm going to be entering body power and maybe other ones if before or after depending how I feel and when I've been watching a lot of bodybuilding competitions on the internet obviously people who are on YouTube who have been bodybuilding and gone to competitions themselves a lot of them are no i've got not the, the tattoo free they've got no tattoos at all they might have the odd little one um but i don't see many people with full sleeves you know chest tattoos you know where the whole body is covered and i i'm i'm a bit worried about my tattoos affecting my progress in actually body power in the competition i don't know if it's just me or it's everybody else but when i see people with tattoos you cannot see the definition you know on that part of the body like i've got a full sleeve basically when i do workouts when i do anything with arms i I can see the definition in my right arm compared to my left. You know, the veins popping out, you know, the muscles where they're developing. With my left arm, I can't see it. I can't see any at all. There is, there is no, you can't, even if I, were, I feel like if I'm going to be shredded, I'm still not going to see anything. Um, obviously, the good point is I haven't got it there, which is good obviously i want to finish my sleeve off one day when i get around to it but when i'm when i'm now i'm thinking of this competition and i'm seeing people i you look you can see every detail in their muscles their fibers you know all everything and obviously when you've got when you've got ink covered covering a certain body part you cannot see him as well. A few examples that are going to come on the screen now of people who I've got tattoos on certain parts of the body. Some are covered in tattoos and some are just got like sleeves. And well-known people you all probably seen before. And yes, they are very, very muscly and very, very toned. And you can tell that still. But now if I compare it to a picture next to somebody who's just as big, with no tattoos which one looks better 
you know, I'm not talking about who looks sexier. Oh, he's, a, he's got tattoos, he's sexier and all that lot. Because this is not about that. This is not about image. This is about you going in a competition and competing against a person who you're probably exactly the same in physique wise, but his his physique stands out more because he hasn't got tattoos. He's got nothing covering him. There's been a few shows on recently, um, been posted on Instagram and you know bodybuilders, you know people on YouTube and that. And I saw a few people with tattoos, and they had one had a a half sleeve, and when he did a flex from the uh, a certain position, all you could see is the outline of the actual muscle. You couldn't see no definition in the arm at all because the tattoo was covering it. Um, but but when you when you looked at his other arm, you could see everything. And I'm really really worried because you look at you just look you just look through the history of bodybuilding, um, the champions. I'm talking about the, the the big boys, you know, in the Olympias and Arnold Classics and all that lot. You don't see anybody with tattoos. They're all tattoo free, and I have never known a person with sleeved arms or full body tattooed win a uh, bodybuilding competition if they have let me know you know and tell me his name so i can have a look but obviously i haven't stumbled across one you know and they might all have tattoos but obviously it might be a tiny little tattoo somewhere but i have never seen it and i am quite worried Obviously, what I bring to the show is going to be the best physique I possibly have ever had. And no matter what, I'm going to be happy. But I don't want something like a tattoo wrecking my chances of a place, you know. And obviously, it's only one arm. I suppose they will look more than just an arm. Um, and they will obviously understand that. That arm is just as good as the other arm just because it's got tattoos. And of course, I would be pitch black in the fake tan. So it will hide most of it. But I am still worried about how how they come across. If there's anybody watching this and have been in bodybuilding competitions and has got a sleeve tattoo or a chest piece or a back piece and, and feels the same way as I do now, I would I would like to know, do you think they don't look at you as more of a contender compared to somebody who hasn't got somebody. Um, because nowadays, tattoos are very popular, very big. Most people have tattoos, most people have sleeves. I am just worried, and I haven't been worried about the whole uh, competition. I've been quite looking forward to it. Obviously, I've had my down days because obviously I'm bulking at the moment, and bulking to me is not fun. Uh, I want to, especially when everybody's cutting at the moment, you see in bodybuilding and they're looking awesome. And I just can't wait to do it next year and do it. But I've never had no worries. Obviously, my conditioning, I'm going to look the best anyway. So I don't really care about if I don't place anywhere because I know I'm going to have the best body I've ever had. But I'm worried about is all this hard work going to be for nothing? And will that even if I, me looking at myself, think, wow, I look great. I, I'm, you know, I've got a chance. I've got a chance. But am I going to not get anywhere because of an arm? When I do like my poses, and which I don't do much because I'm rubbish at them. But when I do a lot of poses, I, I tend to go this way because you can just see definition. It's just like, I mean, I'm bulking and you can see indentations, you know, like obviously... Your chest indentation. Now, if I had it all covered in tattoos, you would you probably wouldn't see it as well because obviously the shadows and that can't hit it. And that's what I mean. The only thing about tattoos, like especially on arms, is this arm always looks beefier and bulkier. There looks more of it because obviously it's darker and it it stands out more compared to that one. Um. 
But that is the only thing I can think of which which is an advantage. It makes it look bigger. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. You know, do you think tattoos do wreck a bodybuilder's chance in a competition? Or do you think it's it's not going to do nothing? You know, it's all in my head and I've got nothing to worry about. Let me know. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time with another video. Goodbye.